JJ Spaz, no doubt close teammates, but close off the field as well. How long have you two been living together? Uh, about a year and a half now. So we've been in this place here for about six months, but the year before, um, in 2021, we were living the whole year together there. So yeah, it's been about 18 months. Now sitting on Nita's couch, can you talk us through that situation? Yeah, so because these, or well, Nita and JJ moved out first, um, I stayed in my host family for an extra year. They'd already bought bought everything for the house, so um, I sort of jumped in late. Typical boys, not too. I was a bit lazy, and I didn't really want to go shopping for anything. So we just took Nita's couch, TV cabinet, and the washing machines, Nita's. So. We just said I'd give him a bank transfer and just take all his stuff from him, save him having to take it back to Adelaide. So, yeah, there's a few things here that are, that are his, but we've just we've just claimed them now. Away from footy, what do you get up to? You've obviously got a day off today. What's in store? Um, pretty quiet. Just try to relax. Um, it's a nice day. We'll get down to the beach or something. Uh, do a bit of uni. Uh, just if there's basketball or NFL or something on, we'll, we'll usually watch that. Um, but yeah, it's pretty chill. Just like, like to relax, put the feet up. In terms of on-field, the two of you played in a similar role last year and almost had to fight for a spot against each other. What was that like? Uh, no, it was, it was good. Like James played his first game last year. It was, it, was, it was pretty cool to be there on that day. It was round one last year. So, And then obviously played in every, in every game after that. So obviously had an outstanding year. Um, James did individually, but also like as the club as a whole. But yeah, we find each other like because we're in the same line and everything, doing everything together becomes a bit of a competition all, all the time. So uh, it's good on the day off, you know, just to relax. And then when you get home, you can sort of switch off a bit. And I think we're pretty good at that. You know, we're not always in each other's hair at home and stuff like that, which is good. We do see the two of you together at training and in the warm up together the whole time. Do you just gravitate towards each other a bit? Yeah, I think um, having that good relationship, um, we do everything together pretty much. Um, and yeah, as I said, we're pretty close mates and just makes it makes it easier. Looking around the house, there are footies all over the ground. Do you often just have balls everywhere in this place? Yeah, there's a few floating around. Um, they get a fair use on, on game day if we go for a little kick or something. Um, but yeah, they're just floating around. It's a bit more lazy, just kind of yeah. cleaning them up. So we sort of take, I sort of, they're normally in my car and I just take them out to go for a kick and then somehow they just end up in the lounge room. So they just stay there. You've got a better together kitchen book. Who does the cooking? Uh, Probably about 50 50 to be honest. It's uh, we sort of just take turns, really. It's just like whoever decides what they want to cook for that night, and then they just go and do it. So, whoever cooks the other cleans, it's pretty much how it goes. Yeah, we got um, our partners did a cooking class, so we just stole the, stole the book off them, and um, yeah, we try to muster up uh, whatever's in that book sometimes. But yeah, if we can be bothered, yeah. often doesn't go to plan. <laughs> Do you keep things pretty simple around the house? There's no frames on the walls, there's nails floating around. Uh, you're pretty relaxed? Yeah, I think it's pretty pretty casual, you know. Before two weeks ago, we didn't even have a fruit bowl or anything like that. It was pretty plain and boring in here, but I mean, like, I don't think it's something we're really too fussed about, you know. We sort of just use the place to, you know, relax and, and stuff like that, so. Um, no, I don't think it really bothers us much having paintings on the wall, so. Any prized possessions? No, just a couple of medals upstairs, maybe. But yeah. that's about it, coffee table. <laughs> very good, well, thanks very much for your time. Uh, we enjoyed the insight. All right, thanks. thanks.